Okay, so I just made a little YouTube short of the update. It wasn't really much of an update. It was more of a funny video. So this is a more in-depth video. If you're like, Deacon, why why do you have two YZ85s? This one, it was, it, my um, my mom's friend hit, like it was like, you want it? And she was like, yeah, and so now I have this one. And then my mom posted on Facebook about me working on this one, and some dude was like, yo, you want this one? I live, live nearby. And that's why I have them. The next question is, why do you need to? Well, see this one, the frame is just, it just messed up. But this one over here, the frame and everything is good, except for the motor. The bottom end is locked up. And so you're like, why? Why is it locked up? Um, the break-in oil was never changed. It was rode for six months on the break-in oil. It locked up the bottom end. And so we're going to take this bottom end out of this one. This is our new parts bike. Say hello to parts bike. Hello, parts bike. Um, we're going to take the bottom end out of this one, put it into that one. I'm going to put an um counter into this video. You're going to see it every time I say um, because I say um a lot because I'm Texan. Okay. Um... The graphics are really ugly. That's that's the biggest downside to this. To this bike right there, incredibly ugly. Oh my god, do you see how ugly? What were they going for, like a snake? A snake? Also, another problem I have with the YZ85s from this era, yes, I'm gonna say era, because I can, is why do they use the gas tank as a ferry? Why would they do such a thing? Just cover it up, bro. I mean, like, you're putting me in tears. It's so ugly. Another good thing with this one, came with a pro circuit. That was really loud, that hurt my ears. Came with a pro circuit. I'm going to put an FMF on it, because I own one, but, or I may keep the pro circuit and put the FMF on my little pit, pit bike right there, my little CR. Pit bike right there, I may do that. But this was a short video, but it was longer than the YouTube short. It gave you information that you may need. And honestly, don't know when the next video is coming out. Hopefully soon. It's just the bottom end replacement. And then you'll see me riding it. Probably get talked to by the cops. Hopefully not, but that's probably going to happen. And that is a little summary of why I own two YZ85s.